Well, the greatest single-game goal scorer ever in women's soccer in the history of the Great Northwest Athletic Conference. Joining us now from Nampa, Ricky Myers, Northwest Nazarene women's soccer standout junior forward. And, Ricky, well, thanks for joining us tonight here on GNAC Insider. Hi, Rob. Thanks for having me. Now, I, I, and I, I didn't oversell what I, just, what I just said. You scored four goals, four goals against Cal State East Bay this past Saturday in winning the Great Northwest Athletic Conference Women's Soccer Offensive Player of the Week Award. I want to talk about the significance of that here in, in just a couple of seconds, as that did break the GNAC record for goals in a single match. When you think back now uh, on, that, on that match, when did you realize that, hey, this is, this is something a little bit special? Um, I actually had no idea that I was even approaching um, a record. I just had a lot of fun playing with my team. Um, they were playing me great balls, and it, was, uh, it felt good to be able to finish that for them. All right, four goals. Have you ever scored four goals in a game before? High school, uh, in, in clubs, uh, in premier, a- any time during your soccer career? Um, I think I've gotten a hat trick a couple times in high school, but I don't think I've ever gotten four before. Well, the reason I say this is so significant is, again, your four goals broke a GNAC soccer history record before you scored those four, three goals had been scored in a single match. Take a guess how many times. I think I read somewhere like maybe 50. 60, 60 times. Wow. And your four goals broke that record that had been tied by 60 different players who wore colors across the Great Northwest Athletic Conference. And you came back. You also had another goal, I should mention, last Thursday. Uh, You scored a goal in uh, the Nighthawks 2-1 win over Hawaii Hilo. Now, you've gotten out of the the gate very hot offensively. Does that surprise you at all? Um, Are you asking about me personally or my team? Well, I'm talking about you personally, because you've got five goals in two games, and on your career now, you have 18. So of those 18, uh, again, five this year already, with obviously some more to come. So talk about your, your, your goal scoring individually. Okay. Um, well, I was hoping to play better this year than I have in the past, which is my goal every year. Um, so I can't say that I was um, expecting to score that much but I do have high expectations for myself and I am satisfied that I was able to finish them so the Nighthawks are are playing very very well right now the team is riding a three game winning streak you're three one and all on the season talk about the team's play just a little bit Uh, what has propelled you to this three game win streak well, I'm very excited about the team this year. Um, we have a very strong starting lineup, um, but also our bench is incredibly strong as well. Um, so many of the girls um, are bought into the program, and we have a saying on our team, believe the best. Um, and I truly believe that each one of the girls on the team is here to give it their all um, and improve our program. So I think we have a lot to look forward to uh, this coming up season just because we're starting off so strong and there's so much heart and soul but also skill. Um, So we, we finally have all the elements to be very successful. Well, and you're successful, as we mentioned, out of the gate at 3-1-0 and on the year. And the GNAC Team of the Week honors also went to Northwest Nazarene University Women's Soccer for uh, that, that great weekend they just had with the 2-1 win over Hawaii Hilo. And then that game against Cal State East Bay, that record-setting performance by our guest here tonight, Ricky Myers from the Northwest Nazarene Women's Soccer Team. Junior forward, you hailed from Mill Creek, uh, which is uh, a little bit uh, outside Seattle. What was it about this NNU program and the university that made you think this would be where I want to get my degree and also to continue my soccer career? Um, Well, I was really impressed with Mary Trigg, my head coach. 
Um, and so when she invited me out for a visit, I was like, well, Nava, Idaho, but I guess we'll take a look. Um, and I just, I really enjoyed the team culture that she works so hard to develop. Everyone is very caring. Um, we're all good friends. But aside from soccer, um, I'm pursuing a degree in wildlife biology, and NNU um, biology program offers some unique opportunities that would um, set me up for success in careers post-graduation. So I was really drawn to not only the team atmosphere, but also just like the biology program that NNU has to offer. You understated your academic performance. You were a GNAC all-academic selection in 2018. You talk about wildlife biology, a 3.44 grade point average in that particular subject area. What is it about wildlife biology that that makes you think, you know, this is where I want to to spend my career? Um, I'm really passionate about conservation, Um, and so... I'm just here. I want to make the world a better place by taking care of it. Um, I'm a Christian here at NNU, and the Bible states that we are stewards of the earth, and so I want to make sure that it's taken care of. Um, And because that's where my passion lies, I think that's a place where my energy is best spent. Talk a little bit about what 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 would be the career path. What what will your title be when you get out into the workaday world? (laughs) <laughs> well, that's the question. <laughs> um, my dream job would be a combination of education as well as um, conservation. So that's what I would hope to get. Um, but some different jobs available include like research, um, which I could go around the world and do, um, or even just in the U.S., or like park ranger, um, working for fish and wildlife, things like that. I haven't narrowed in on one quite yet. Well, great in academics, great in athletics. Ricky Myers, our guest here tonight, second team all GNAC, a two-time second team all GNAC selection. And again, the uh, top individual goal scorer ever in GNAC women's soccer history with four goals against Cal State East Bay this past Saturday. Okay, great past weekend for you. Talk a little bit about what's upcoming for Northwest Nazarene and how you keep this three-game win streak going. Well, that's the um, big question. (laughs) As a captain, I want to make sure that um, we can keep this streak going, um, which I'm very hopeful about. Um, I think it takes a lot from each individual player making the conscious choice um, to perform their best in order for the team to succeed. Um, And I think we have that. So we're really excited for our games this weekend, which are against some challenging teams, to test our perseverance um, in order to get that win again. Do you feel there's still room for growth for this year's Nighthawks team? Absolutely. There's always room for growth. Um, But as long as we get a little better every day, then I'm satisfied with that. Well, Ricky, I know you, uh, we talked before we began this interview here tonight on GNAC Insider, and I know that you're studying tonight, and I'm going to let you get back to that. But I certainly appreciate very much your, uh, your time here tonight. Congratulations on a record. And I'll tell you one thing, I, I don't know how long that four goals is going to stand, but I feel pretty confident in saying it's going to stand for quite a while here in the Great Northwest Athletic Conference. Congratulations on being the Offensive Player of the Week Congratulations to your team for being the team of the week. And I sincerely hope that we have the opportunity to, to talk again sometime before your career is over there at Northwest Nazarene here on GNAC Insider. Well, thank you so much.